What is up, mustard packets? Okay, so this is going to be sort of a follow-up video on the last commentary I did where I talked about working out, keeping in shape, eating right, and, and how easy it really is to find ourselves off track with, with that and our fitness goals. Uh, first off, in the last video, there was a whole lot of you who said, you know what, you're right. I'm going to start working out now. Let's do this. And I'm curious as to how many of you are really keeping up with it. I know... I know how hard it can be to, you know, start it and keep up with it. Uh, I can't count how many times I've started a workout and then stopped and then started and then stopped again. And it's just a pattern that I would repeat for, for a very, very long time until I finally found something uh, that I can stick with. And it's really all about finding what works with you, what makes it fun, what makes you want to keep doing it. Uh, me right now, I've worked out a few times a week over the last couple of weeks since I did the commentary. Uh, it's not as much as I would like to work out, but really doing a little something is better than sitting on my ass all day and, and doing nothing. Uh, today, actually, I ran in uh, a local 5K uh, race or run or, or whatever. One of our uh, local running clubs in the suburb uh, near where I live once a month does a $1 entry fee 5K run. And it's a really nice run, but the, the last time I actually did a 5k run was almost a year ago. I did it at the Warrior Dash. If you guys don't know what that is, that's a 5k mud run slash obstacle course. And it's, it's really a lot of fun, but I was in a lot better shape. I was working out every day back then. And really, you know, I was never much of a distance runner anyway. Uh, I didn't need it when I was, when I was really in shape. I, you know, I played football. I played tight end in football. And I played first base in baseball. I don't have to run very far in either of those positions. Okay, now back to today's 5K. Man, nothing hurts your ego more than seeing the mom with the stroller hit her 1.5 mile mark as you're hitting your one mile mark. I mean, even if the mom is completely ripped to shreds, has a six pack, and is beating, you know, 90, 95% of the other runners, it's just a good swift kick to the balls. But you know what? I fucking did it. I could have slept in today, been lazy, uh, but I got up off my ass at 6 a.m. and I went and ran 3.15 miles, and then I went home and took a nap. And let me tell you, that was a good nap. Um, anyway, I'm really interested to see how many of you guys kept up with it. Uh, I don't know if many of you guys know this, but after the last video, I set up a little forum on my Facebook page. It's facebook.com forward slash barbaric mustard i suggest you follow it uh i've heard of issues recently with youtube uh not showing everybody's videos in the little subscriber panel you know the the recent videos or whatever i post every one of my videos that i post on youtube i put a link to on my facebook page so you'll always catch it there anyway uh there's a forum on my facebook page if you go down it's right next to where the uh, little picture icon is it looks like a little uh, text box or a little like a comic book text box or whatever uh, if you click that in there is a little forum that uh, i put together for people to actually talk about their fitness goals and, and kind of keep each other motivated uh nobody's really posted in there for the last nine days until today so i'm, I'm really curious to see uh, how many of you guys are keeping up with it um anyway guys that's really all i have so, you know, have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, whatever time it happens to be, wherever you happen to be, and take care, and I'm going to go ice my ankle down.